what's going on guys welcome back to the channel today we're going to be cleaning this 17 year old truck it's a pretty dirty work truck i don't think it's ever been cleaned there's like literally a half inch of dirt and grime and grease all on the floor um, tons on the seat it's just really gross stinks really bad so we're gonna deep clean it and I'm gonna show you guys I'm gonna show you guys how it turned out stay tuned all right guys so now I'm just gonna use this cheap steamer I'm gonna clean up the interior a little bit and it's inside's really dirty see it has a lot a lot of dirt up in here doesn't look like it's ever been cleaned really Doors are dirty. Uh, it comes with a free, uh, free screwdriver. This is pretty nasty up here. Um, it needs a new headliner. But lots and lots of dirt. It stinks. But it's the only. Okay, I think I'm just gonna focus on the floors. I need a vacuum for the seats, but let's uh, start cleaning this. Before this video starts, can you guys do me a huge favor and hit that like and subscribe button down below? It really helps out the channel and motivates me to make more videos. So hit that thumbs up button, guys. I appreciate it.
All right, guys, so here's the truck. Uh, she's been coming a long way. She's actually a pretty nice truck now compared to when I first bought it, it was a mess. And this is the inside now. You can see it's pretty clean. I actually had to get a drill brush attachment for my drill to really get everything out. Just a little bit of lease and stuff, but for the most part, it's actually really clean now. I got pretty much all the stuff out of the floor. I'm sure you guys saw before how nasty it was. Everything was really, really dirty. I still want to take the seats out and get under the seats. That's the only thing I really haven't done yet. I also want to take this dashboard off and clean really good under there because you can see like leaves in there and stuff and there's a bunch of stuff coming out of there. So I want to get that out and really make sure everything on there is clean. Um, but yeah, this, uh, I use this tough stuff spray on the seats along with the steamer. Uh, like I was saying in another video, there was tons of like grease caked up on all the seats. Really? The driver's seat was the worst. It had a ton. You can't even tell now, but there was like this giant circle of grease. That was just disgusting. Got a little seat cover on there now for the rip. But these seats, so much dirt came out of them. I'm gonna show you all the rags that I use to scrub everything. Uh, I can only get this. This is really just um, like peeling up and stuff. I can only get this so clean. But I did, I used that tough stuff to spray the headliner too. I got a lot of dirt out of there. Um, just for the most part, I clean back there a lot. I just got a lot of this dirt out. Pretty much got a lot of the stench out. It's just actually a drivable truck now. Uh, before driving in it, it was just, it would stink so bad, you just couldn't even drive it. It was really, really disgusting. Um, but now it's actually not bad. You know, it's uh, passable for a work truck. So I have a bag of the rags that I use. I'm gonna grab them. I got the doors kind of clean. There's a lot of like nicks and marks and stuff. This was definitely a work truck. So it was one and it's going to be one. So like I've been telling you guys, I'm not a, you know, a ton of concerned, but I do want to get under these seats and get all the nasty stuff under there too. So the driver's side. If I remove this, you can see you know, it's gotten dirty again. It's been a few days since I cleaned it. There's some stuff here and there. But all the nasty caked up stuff is all pretty much gone. Well, you wouldn't believe how much I actually got out of here. It was truly gross. That's where I think a lot of this um, stink was coming from. Cleaned up the door as best I could. There's a lot of scratches and stuff. Um, I got back there. This seat's kind of broken, so. I got a lot back there. It still needs vacuumed and like I said, take these seats out so I can really, so I can really get back there and under there really good. But for now, I got tons of the dirt out. I sprayed right here um, tons and there's still even more. So I'm gonna get like a carpet deep cleaner and uh try to get even more out of these seats eventually but i'm no detail geek guys but it'll pass now now if you if you guys really could understand how disgusting this was then this truck honestly looks like a brand new truck it's still there's tons of dirt that could still be taken out like in the vents and stuff but it's night and day difference in here. Yeah, I don't care if it's a dirty, dirty truck in general. It's gonna get dirty from working and mortar and dust and all that stuff. But it, I can't believe someone even let it get that bad. It was, I keep saying this, but it was literally unbelievably disgusting in here. I'll show you. All right, guys, this is the giant pile of rags that I use to clean up in here and I threw away all the really bad ones 
because they were just completely black. They went from yellow to black and they were just, they, they were really stinky. They stunk really bad, so I just threw them away. I didn't even save them. These are all the ones I was just scrubbing the seats and they would get wet. I was scrubbing the floor, I was scrubbing everything with all these different rags. Some of them you can see are kind of gross. It was just, I can't even explain. Look at that. Ugh. It was really terrible. And like I said, I threw away the really bad ones. So these are all the ones that I can still use for like, just throwaway rags. It was gross in here. Just to give you a little idea of how much I actually cleaned out of here. All right, that's gonna be all guys. I uh, hope you enjoy the little update on the truck. Hope you enjoy this cleaning video. Like I said, I'm no detail geek, but I can live with it now. I've been doing tons of work to this truck and it's uh, coming along video by video. Still got lots of stuff to do, so you guys stay tuned if you wanna see some more cat eye videos and me fixing up this old work truck. Got lots planned for it. So with that being said, guys, hit that like and subscribe button. And, and that's it guys. I hope you have a great day. Peace.